Hey YouTube, this is Dave, and today I'd like to make a video about free TV and movie services. Um, well, actually, one of them is free, and the other ones, the other two are $9.99, one-time fee, lifetime membership. So, yeah, I may have mentioned these apps or these websites before in other videos that, uh, you know, featured some of these links. But this video is dedicated solely to what you can do on your iOS and on your computer at home, whether it's Chrome uh, or Safari or Windows Explorer or whatever it may be. Today I'll be showing you on Chrome, and I prefer Chrome because there's some things that you can do on Chrome that you may not be able to do on Internet Explorer. And I'm also going to be featuring it also uh, showing it on an iOS 7 device here, the iPhone 5. So I'm going to show you these websites, uh, how they work on both the Mac and how they work on the iOS device. So let's get started. The first uh, thing I want to show you is uh, Movie Land. Okay, so I paid $9.99 a couple of years ago and I got this movie site. Uh, which is, you know, you have to sign in, you have to be a member, uh, and you pretty much can get movies that are in the theater. Uh, for instance, uh, the new movie, uh, The Hunger Games, Catch and Fire. That's there. Uh, it's cam quality for now, but then once the DVD comes out, or they get a better, uh, like a rip from a DVD that the movie theaters use, then they will post it. Uh, you can see here in Movie Land on the computer, uh, same thing, uh, you just click on it and there goes the Hunger Games right over here. So you can do this in the mobile and by the way this works on Android too. Um, you might have to download a like MX player or something like that in order for it to work uh, or, and have Chrome. You can't use the stock Android uh, internet um, you know, app. So here we have it on the computer and where you can get movies that are still in a theater and then they also have older movies that are ripped from DVDs about 1700 movies uh, different genres and different uh, you know categories so you basically can go in by alphabetical uh, same thing with the uh, iOS app uh, you can go into older movies and basically search by alphabetical so let's give you a demo since uh, the newest movie is Catching Fire. Let's take a look at that. So here's an in-theater movie. And we can just click on the movie there. And you'll see right on the iOS device, tap to download. Now, it couldn't be easier than that. Let's turn it sideways so you can get a better look at it. And you'll see, I'm over Wi-Fi right now but you'll see that it plays beautifully. Uh, actually, I can't show it to you with Air Server, but uh, trust me, it's working great. And you'll see that I have it on my MacBook Pro, but I can play it on the iOS device right to the MacBook Pro, since I'm mirroring right now. So basically, we hit play. Play. And there you have Catching Fire. So let's just fast forward a little bit. You know, I'm watching this on my Mac. It's still in the theater. Now let me show it to you on the. Let me show it to you on the uh, on the Mac how it works. And the great thing about the Mac is that you can. Um, you can also save these files. So let me show you. We'll go back to, um, let me close that out so that we get back into mirroring again. All right, so we're done mirroring. Move that over. Okay, so now let me show it to you on the computer. Um, so if I go to uh, movies, now, once again, $9.99 for a lifetime membership. And here is Catching Fire down here somewhere. Oh, in theater movies. 
and you go and click Hunger Games and it will open up to its page and then if you want to download it to your Mac you just right mouse button save link as and it will actually save as as a mp4 right there on your on your computer so if we'll hit the downloads that's where we'll go and we'll hit save so now you'll see down here it's saving it as an mp4 it's a 1.5 gigabyte and you can also stream it and right there in your Chrome browser can't be easier than that that's for sure and once it loads up um, we will get our movie there's a lot of people watching it right now and you can also go full screen let's fast for it now this is streaming it I don't want to give away the ending but basically you can fast forward along this entire arena seems to be laid out like a clock. All right. I don't want to show you too much of it because it's a new movie. Most of you haven't seen it yet, probably. Then again, most of you probably have seen it already because it's doing really good in the theaters. So let me now just pause that and let's go back to Movie Land. So that was Movie Land, and you could do it on the iOS, Android, you could do it on Windows, Mac, or whatever. $9.99 lifetime membership. Not a month, I'm talking $9.99, and that's it. And you never ever have to pay again. I've been using it for years now. There's no scandal. There's no nothing. There's, they're not going to steal your credit card information. These people that I know and I talk to on Twitter all the time. And um, the good thing is, if you wanted to, you can go to CVS and buy yourself a Visa card, a prepaid Visa card for, you know, 20 bucks or whatever. And then you can use that Visa card to buy the service. And that's it. Throw the card away. You don't have to give anybody your, your credit card number or anything like that. Now, everybody I tell about these services that are friends of mine, they constantly thank me for this. Because believe me, you got everything on here. But we're not done yet. Let me show you now another service. Same people, TV Land. Okay? Let me close this out and I'll show you TV Land. So TV Land is here. And by the way, uh, these are over the web on iOS as well as on the Chrome on the Mac. Um, but the reason why I have icons on my desktop is because I go to Safari, I type in, and I'll have the links in the description, and, and then I hit Shows. And then what do I do? I... Um, after I got shows, see view by title. This is, this is TV land now. Uh, what I do is I go in and I hit this button right here at the bottom. And I'll add to home screen. And you'll see, you can name it whatever you want. And then you add. And then you see it shows up here. But uh, we don't need it. We already have it. So here it is, TV land. Let me open that up. Here is TV land on iOS. And when you see this, you're going to call your cable company tomorrow. And I'm only doing this because I hate paying cable bills. And uh, I don't want to see you guys pay cable bills either. So here we have view by title. Okay. Just like Movie Land. And here's view by title. Okay. So what do we want to watch? You want to watch uh, Broadwalk Empire? No problem. Let's scroll on down to all these wonderful being human that's on there. Uh, Broadwalk Empire. Let's click it. Let's go to the iOS device and let's hit Broadwalk Empire. Let's go to it. And we'll click it. Now you pay $9.99 one time with your prepaid Visa card. Don't sweat it. You never have to give out any of your personal information. So now we're here in Broadwalk Empire and we're in season four. And here is season four. Now notice that we downloaded earlier. And here is the Catching Fire movie. It's still downloading. All right. So now you want to watch the latest Broadwalk Empire. So let's click that. And you can stream it right to your Chrome browser. And let's do it right here on iOS as well. 
Let's go full screen. Now, this is DVD quality, guys. I mean, there it is. So let's escape that. I don't want to copyright, so I'm going to pause it. And being that we're already mirroring my device, we're going to put it right here on the screen. And this is the iOS. This is iOS. And we're going to hit play. And there it is. It's playing right on your iPhone, iOS 7. And it's playing here on the computer. And it's got every single episode updated within a couple of days of the show airing live. How could you even think about paying cable? All right, so let's go back. So let's close this out. Let's go back to mirroring. And I will show you the next service. Now, while, while you're chewing this about and thinking that you don't want to, you know, bother and give your credit card and whatever nonsense reason that you have, uh, you're going to say to yourself, uh, you know, I need something that's free. All right, well, let's do that. First of all, let me just show you a couple of more what kind of movies they have. So if we go view by title, now let's see, what do you like? American Horror Story? Bam. Amer American Dad? American Horror Story? What do you want to see? You want to see uh, Boardwalk Empire? Let's find another thing. What else do I watch? I watch uh, Person of Interest. Where are you? Right here. Person of Interest. Look, every season. Every episode. Start from the beginning. Watch the ones you missed. $9.99 lifetime membership. What can I tell you? I mean, uh, what else we have? We got these movies. So so far, 18 bucks, you got these two services. You got Movie Land and you got TV Land. Okay? And you're not gonna go wrong. Now, in case you wanted something free, let's show you that. So I showed you Movie Land, I showed you TV Land on iOS. Now, here's something that is only mobile. But I'm also going to show you how to trick your this website to thinking that you're a mobile on your desktop computer. Be patient, I'll show you. So first of all, you type in iStreamNet.net right in your browser. Right up here. Okay? And it will automatically change to iShows. And what you're going to get is you're going to get all of these TV shows. Let me go to the blog on this. See, what happens on your computer at home is you get the blog. Uh, this website frowns on you using it on your Mac for whatever reason. I don't know why. Uh, but here on mobile, you see all these TV shows. Let's go through them. I can't show you enough. I, I could spend hours showing you all the shows that they have. You want to catch up on Sopranos? Bam, there goes Sopranos every season. Let's go back. Let's keep going. Cleveland Show. Look. What else do we have? Sons of Anarchy. And that's on TV Land, too. You want to catch up on all the South Park that you missed? There you go. Mythbusters. Lost. If you want to catch up on Lost, you want to Glee? You want Futurama? What do you want? Every episode of Family Guy? What? You want to watch all of Dexter? All of Breaking Bad? Go right ahead. Oh, look, they have Broadwalk Empire, too. And American Dad. So, this one is free. And let me show you how this one works. So, say you wanted to watch Sons of Anarchy. You want Season 6. Okay? And now, they'll show up here. Let's scroll down to the latest episode. And let's play that. So, we click on that. Now, the only thing with this site, because it's free, is you can only get 480p unless you're a v VIP member, which you might want to do, but it's $4.99 a month. Uh, it's better than Hulu, that's for sure. It's got more shows. But anyway, let's watch the show. So you hit watch, and you got to wait 28 seconds. Every episode you watch, you got to wait 28 seconds. They want you to read the advertisement. They want to get paid. So that's how they get paid. They don't take your info. You don't have to give them a credit card. You don't even have to sign up. You don't even have to sign in. You don't have to do anything. You just go to your iOS device, put the link in, search the show, show you want. Next thing you know, 29 seconds later, you're watching that episode. Let's turn it sideways. 
let's scroll to where it's counting down. So there's it's I was here a second ago. Ah, there it is. So now it gives you a play button, and then you hit play. And guess what, folks? You're watching in a second. It's only taken a long time because I have it on mirror because I'm trying to make this video. But watch this. And it plays without commercials. Previously on Sons of Anarchy. Want to airplay it to your Mac with air server? Full screen, baby. Yes. The pregnancy. Is it a lie? How could you beat that? Let's close that out. Let's go back to the mirror. And we will mirror. Oops, sorry about that. Right, so we're back to mirroring. So I showed you that. And you can try that one out right away. Now, how are we going to do this on the Mac? Now, what do you get when you put in iShows? And it recognizes that it's a desktop. So what do you do? You download this extension from the Chrome Web Store. And this extension is called UA User Agent Switcher for Chrome. You just go into Settings. You go into Extensions. And then you search user agent switcher for Chrome. So what that's going to do is when you're in iShows, all right, and you click here, you're going to trick your website into thinking that you're an iOS device. I would choose iOS and iPad. And now watch what happens. Here is the iShows. Let's close it and let's reopen it. I have it bookmarked here. And hey, it actually, the website actually thinks that I'm a iPad. So what do we do? We have all this. Unfortunately, you can't scroll because it's touchpad. So what you do, you pinch. And you pinch it down to real small. Now you wanted to watch, I don't know, uh, you wanted to watch Person of Interest. <clears throat> Excuse me. Being that you're pinched down as small as you can, you can basically just see every episode on one page without scrolling. Let's watch the episode. He sees this 27 seconds. Just like just like the app here. Let me wait for that. So we're going to wait for that and I'm going to airplay again. Sorry about that. Play. All right, so here's the video. Uh, wait for the play button to load. All right, well, let me try that again. I'm sorry, I wasn't looking because I was doing that airplay. I guess we don't need to do that. So let's wait for the 29 seconds, and you'll see that it will play. So 14 seconds. So now what do we have here? We have a free app. We have a free website for movies. And we have two very small amount, $9.99 lifetime memberships for these two, TV Land and Movie Land. Um, once the video loads, you're going to see a play button. And believe me, it works. But you probably want to use it Use it on your iOS device. Get an app like Air Server, uh, which allows you to AirPlay from your iOS to your computer. Or if you have an Apple TV, you can AirPlay any of these shows to the Apple TV from your iOS device and from your Mac. And if you have an older Mac, like I said, you can use Air Server. So anyway, I'm babbling on. I'm babbling on. I guess. This doesn't work that good, but it does work. Uh, it just is not going to work with this episode. But you have them on your iOS device. You have them on your Android device. Don't forget, you can use this on Android. Just use Chrome and MX Player uh, when it asks you what video uh, you know, app to use. So there you have it. Three, episode, three different things that you can do to get rid of your cable bill. 
And um, I know I'm babbling on, but uh, I am showing you three websites. And I want to make sure that you get the idea because I've been preaching about this and everybody I preach to, they told me, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you a million times. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, you know, leave them in the comments. Please like this video, share it. And uh, if you uh, have any questions, you know, just ask. And all the links will be in the description. Uh, and that's it. So have a nice day. I'll see you in my next video.